animals. Correct! The Great Sphinx is a huge statue with the body of a lion and the head of a man. The face was carved to look like an Egyptian king. Now take the picture. <laughs> Please go to Europe and take a picture of the Berlin Wall Memorial. You're almost there. Correct. Now take... <laughs> Please go to Africa and take a picture of the Sahara. You're almost there. Correct! The Sahara is the largest desert on Earth. The Sahara is so hot and dry that even when it rains, the drops often disappear before reaching the ground. Now take the picture. Oh. oh, Melvin. Please go to Australia and take a picture of the Sydney Opera House. You're almost there. Great job. The Sydney Opera House sits on the edge of the ocean. It has a roof that looks like sails. Now take the picture. <laughs> Please go to North America and take a picture of an Aztec temple. You're almost there. Excellent. Aztec temples like this were built by the Aztec Indians over a thousand years ago. Now take the picture. <laughs> Please go to North America and take a picture of the Statue of Liberty. You're almost there. All right. The Statue of Liberty is a symbol of freedom. Visitors can go up into the statue and look out through windows in the crown. Now take the picture. <laughs> oh, Melvin. Please go to Africa and take a picture of the Nile River. You're almost there. Nice work. The Nile is the longest river on Earth. Now take the picture. <laughs> oh, well. Please go to South America and take a picture of the Amazon rainforest. You're almost there. Wonderful. The Amazon rainforest is the largest tropical rainforest on Earth. Armadillos, giant anteaters, anaconda snakes, and other fascinating animals live there. Now take the picture. <laughs> Please go to Africa and take a picture of the Great Sphinx. South America is a continent with mountains running all along one edge. The very bottom of South America is shaped like an animal's sharp horn. The Andes Mountains are the longest chain of mountains on Earth. Some mountains in the Andes are volcanoes that still erupt. The Inca Indians built the city of Machu Picchu high on a mountain long ago. Parts of the buildings and the city wall are still standing today. All wildlife is protected on the Galapagos Islands, including huge turtles, iguanas, and blue-footed seabirds. Andes Mountains are... The 
Inca Indian. The Amazon. North America. The beautiful Grand Canyon is over one mile deep. As the sunlight changes, the canyon rocks look like they're turning different colors. The island of Greenland isn't very green. Most of it is covered all year by a thick layer of ice and snow. Antarctica is the Snow Hill Island is one of the places in Antarctica where scientists from all around the world work together to study the cold, icy environment. The South Pole is as far south as you can go. is the longest river on earth. The continent of Europe is connected to the continent of Asia. A long chain of mountains runs along the border. Stonehenge may have once been used by sun worshippers. Experts are still puzzled about how the huge stones were moved into place. The Colosseum was the very first sports stadium. It was sometimes filled with water for people to come watch pretend sea battles. In ancient times, Athens was the Earth's leading city. The remains of ancient buildings still stand alongside modern buildings. The Eiffel Tower was built over 100 years ago. At that time, The Indian Ocean is sometimes called the Middle Ocean because it is between the Atlantic and Pacific. Asia is the largest of the seven continents. Mount Fuji is the tallest mountain in Japan. At the top is the crater of a volcano that no longer erupts. China's emperors used to live in the imperial palace with its 9,999 rooms. If you were to live in a new room every day from the day you were born, you would be 27 years old before running out of rooms. King of India had the Taj Mahal built as a burial place for his queen. It took thousands of workers and about 20 years to build. The city of Bangkok was first built The Great Wall of China is the longest wall on earth. Guard towers and a roadway for horses were built along the top. <coughs> On April 
Australia is the smallest and flattest of the seven continents. It is sometimes known as the land down under. The island of Tasmania has many fascinating plants, including eucalyptus trees. Eucalyptus trees grew even during the time of dinosaurs. The Sydney Opera House sits on the edge of the ocean. It has a roof that looks like sails. The inner area of Australia, called the outback, is flat and dry, with very, very few people. Ayers Rock is a huge mountain right in the middle of the Australian desert. <laughs>